Good morning, first graders and kindergartners. I'm back with your last two clues today for the Esta mystery we started working on yesterday. Again, you're trying to figure out how many sinkers are in this vase. So today we're going to reveal clues four and five. Hopefully you remember where you left off yesterday. Again, you'll need to change your numbers around if you have, um, if, if your number doesn't fit the clues that we had from yesterday. So clue four today says to cross off numbers that are part of this pattern, five, 10, 15. So lots of different counting patterns to, to practice today and yesterday. Um, so you gotta think about what are we counting by here? What are we counting by here? What are we counting by here? We wanna make sure we don't have numbers that are counting by twos, two, four, six. We want to make sure that our number does not is not part of our counting by threes pattern, three, six, nine. Again, today we're crossing out a new pattern, five, 10, 15. Some of the numbers might already be crossed off from yesterday. So you might not have as many to cross off today. And clue five says, one of the objects sank. It has three colors. See the three colors there, green, white, and orange. The answer does not include the digit three. So if you are currently looking at your number and it has a three in it, that number is not correct. You'll need to make one more adjustment. Again, you can always pause the video to make sure that you're on the right track or you have time to think. And then hopefully you have your number ready to go. Now we're gonna go ahead and reveal. Let's see what the answer is today. It is... 29 objects. There are 29 sinkers in this space. If you got the number correct, congratulations. Think back. If you didn't get it correct, how close were you? Were you pretty close to 29 when you first started this? Was your estimate reasonable? And of course, we'd like to thank Steve Wyborny for these great estimate mysteries. And I hope you have a great rest of the day. Bye.